Good morning, everyone. I'm Elliot Mainzer, the President and CEO of the California Independent System Operator. Uh, for today's update on grid conditions, I again would like to start by thanking California consumers and businesses who responded to our request to conserve yesterday because you came through with some truly helpful reductions in your power use. Our preliminary numbers show a 1200 megawatt savings through our flex alert and other calls for conservation and your efforts had a positive impact on grid stability and helped us get through the day without serious problems. Another flex alert will be in effect today from 4 to 9 p.m. So we again hope you cut your electricity use during those hours by raising your thermostat to 78 or higher, health permitting, avoid using major appliances, and turning off any unnecessary lights. Yesterday was a challenge for everyone. The prolonged heat wave across much of California and the West pushed demand to its highest levels for our grid since September 2017. Today we want everyone to know the hottest weather in this extended heat wave is still ahead of us. Much of California will see record triple digit temperatures with only moderate cooling at night right through the Labor Day holiday weekend and into the middle of next week. So electricity conservation is going to be essential in keeping the power flowing to California without interruption. So the challenge continues until this heat wave dissipates. But if California consumers and businesses continue to pitch in and conserve during those key hours of 4 to 9 p.m. when strain on the system is highest, we can make a real difference and work through these challenges together. Thank you again for listening and pitching in. We'll continue to keep you all informed as we move through the next few days and beyond. And if you'd like to track real-time grid conditions, you can do so on our app, ISO Today or also on our website at www.kaiso.com. Thanks again.